The patient is a 30-year-old male with a large hepatocellular carcinoma affecting segments 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8. The right hepatic artery branches are involved and enlarged to supply the tumor. But the patient has a replaced left hepatic artery that is not affected. The tumor pushes against the right portal vein, the right hepatic duct, and the right and middle hepatic veins. The surgical plan is to perform an extended right hepatectomy with resection of segments 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8. The transection margin follows the left of the falciform ligament to the root of the middle hepatic vein. However, the future liver remnant, FLR, Volume was deemed insufficient for a safer section. A right portal vein embolization was performed to induce hypertrophy in the FLR. But the increased liver volume after eight weeks is still not adequate. A rescue associating liver partition and portal vein ligation for staged hepatectomy, ALPS, is therefore planned to further promote growth of the FLR. ALPS is a two-stage procedure. In stage one, a partial liver transection will be performed to the level of the biliary plate, leaving approximately 10% of the transection plane intact, which will be transected in the stage two procedure. The transection is done to the level of the biliary plate to avoid having the bile duct problems after stage one that could preclude the second stage. A segment four hepatic vein branch. A segment four hepatic artery branch. And a segment four portal vein branch will be divided. The right portal vein will be divided channeling the majority of the portal flow to the FLR. On the other hand, the partitioned right lobe artery inflow, biliary outflow, and hepatic outflow will be preserved in the stage one procedure. After nine days post stage one, the FLR volume has increased by 30% and is sufficient for the planned extended right hepatectomy. The right hepatic artery branches will be divided. The cystic duct and the right hepatic duct will be divided. The segment 4 pedicle will be divided. And the remaining liver transection will be performed. The middle hepatic vein will be divided. Special attention will be made to preserve a segment 3 hepatic vein branch draining into the middle hepatic vein to ensure adequate outflow of the remnant liver. The right hepatic vein will be divided. The specimen will be removed, completing the ALPS procedure. 